All right, this is Brother Ken once again. Welcome to Fresh Fire Prayer Ministry, where we keep the fire of the Holy Spirit burning. Today is the day the Lord has made. We'll rejoice and be glad in it. We are just about to exit this mountain. Starting from next week, which will be June, the month of June, we are starting our two weeks marathon fasting and prayer as we step into um, next week. That will be Monday, May 29th. May 29th to Sunday, 11th of June. Two weeks. We are starting our two weeks marathon fasting and prayers. And we are believing God to see us through the month of June and the other subsequent month ahead of us. So we are embarking on a two weeks fasting and prayer. There's power in fasting and there's power in prayer. When we humble ourselves in fasting and prayer, there's no mountain. There's no problem. There's no challenge that you and I cannot overcome. Recently, God told me, son, there is no problem that does not answer to prayer. There is no problem you and I will ever have or will have which cannot answer to prayer or which will not answer to prayer or which must not answer to prayer. Prayer is the key. Why is it so? Because whenever you pray, you invoke God into the scene. You invite God into the situation. And when God is invited into any situation, the God factor solves every mystery, solves every complication, any crisis, any problem, any challenge, any situation. When you bring in the God factor, when you pray to God in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ by the power of the Holy Spirit and you mix it with fasting, there is no problem, there's no challenge, there's no crisis, there's no situation, there's no complication, there's no, ch there's nothing that you are going through that God will not come through for you. So God says that problems, every problem answer to prayer. It's not the prayer itself, it's the fact that prayer is the medium by which we communicate to God and invite God to intervene into our situation and turn situations around. When you bring God into any equation, it doesn't matter how difficult, how challenging, how stressful, how impossible with God, all things are possible. And all things are possible to them that believe in God. And that which is impossible with men are possible with our God. So bring God involved in your problem and you have no problem. Problem solved. Jesus says, I am the way. I am the truth. And I am the life. He's the way maker. He's the red sea divider. He's the mountain mover. He's the light in our darkness. He's the God of miracles. He's the God of the impossibility. I encourage you to join us for this two weeks for, uh, marathon fasting and prayer. And your life will never be the same. Starting from Monday, the 29th May. From May, so we are fasting from May 29th till Sunday 11th of June, Sunday 11th of June, that will make it two weeks and we are starting from Monday the 29th which is from the fasting start from 6 a.m. in the morning to 6 p.m. in the evening. We start the fasting from 6 a.m. in the morning, we don't eat any food, we only drink water and we break at 6 p.m. When we break the fast and then you can eat food and then you join us in the evening for prayers and um the lord will come through the theme for the fasting is breakthrough 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 so we'll be breaking some limitations breaking some curses breaking some witchcraft breaking some um hexes breaking some sickness and this will be breaking and as we break then you'll be passing through you break then you pass through that is what breakthrough two words break we are breaking, dismantling, destroying, vandalizing the works of the enemy. And you are now penetrating, breaking, and passing through to fulfill your glorious destiny. Seeing God's prophetic word concerning your life come to pass. Seeing your marriage restored. Seeing your job. Seeing yourself receiving your job. Your dreams and visions coming to pass. Seeing God move in the life of your son, your daughter. Transform their lives. Bring salvation. Break your husband's 
or the spirit of any addiction and to destroy the works of witchcraft, spells, charms, hexes, divination, enchantment, attack of sickness and diseases and confusion in families. We are breaking the powers of the enemy and we are passing through and seeing God's glory manifest in our life. Breakthrough, don't miss this opportunity to join the saints all over the world. Uh, as we do this two weeks fasting and prayer and it has always been a blessing from 6 a.m. in the morning to 6 p.m. in the evening and every evening at 10 p.m. Eastern Time 10 p.m. Eastern Time from Monday to Thursday Fridays will be 11 p.m. 10 p.m. Eastern Time USA but um, on Fridays it's 11 p.m. and um, you join us on the prayer line the number to call is 563-999 3626 563-999-3626 call that number and join us every day um, 10 p.m monday to thursday friday 11 p.m eastern time for prayer uh, you can also join the prayer line live through facebook and a facebook name my first uh, so invite me on facebook and you can watch us live and my first name is k-a-y the first name is k a Y and the last name is B O A C H I E B O A C H I E. So go to Facebook and invite me. I will accept it, and then you can watch us live 10 p.m. Eastern Time from Monday to Thursday, Friday 11 p.m. Eastern Time, and um, watch us live. Or you can join us also through our Block Talk Radio. I'm going to leave all this information at the bottom of this broadcast. The time, the and all the medium by which you can join us and um, connect to the prayers uh, with us. Those of you who are joining us from Europe, it will be you joining us at, um, those of you in London, it will be 3 a.m., 3 a.m. every day, and it will be on sun Saturday, it will be 4 a.m. So if you're in London, joining us through Facebook or the Block Talk Radio, remember the time to join us live will be 3 a.m. Monday, to Friday and Saturday will be 4 a.m. If you are calling or connecting to us from Europe, that will be 4 a.m. Monday to Friday, but Saturday will be 5 a.m. And those of you from Africa and the rest of the world, the information you can join us live once again through Facebook. And my, my Facebook name is K-A-Y. The last name is B-O-A-C-H-I-E. And there's another link called Block Talk Radio, whereby you can also listen to it as a radio broadcast. All you need is an, is an internet, not a telephone number. And that one also, I'm going to leave the, um, the information at the bottom of this broadcast. So make sure you um, look at the information at the bot or bottom of this video and you'll see all the information you need. I'll also leave the information about the conference I'll be having in London. I'll be coming to London on july 28th 29th and 30th uh, for a deliverance conference and i'll also be in brooklyn um, for a deliverance conference coming soon so just make sure you join us this coming um uh, two weeks uh, marathon fasting and prayer and i don't know what you are believing god for in as we enter we exit this month of may and enter into the month of june um, you'll be blessed and the Lord will help us to fulfill his destiny. As we are entering into the month of June, God is saying that he wants us to step out in faith to fulfill his purposes concerning our lives in this year, 2017. Um, God says his name is Alpha. He is the Alpha and he's the Omega, the beginning and the end. There are people who must start. They must start things in their lives as the Lord is leading them, but they have been, they've been hesitant. They, they are deferring, procrastinating, lazing about and not starting, sometimes because of fear. But in this, as we are stepping into the new month, you got to step, um, step out in faith and do what God has called you to do. Uh, don't fear, don't be worried. Step out and God will provide. And also there are people who have started some projects or started some things, but somehow have been stranded in the middle and have abandoned uh, uh, and yeah, the, the, the vision and God says is the Omega. When God starts something, he must accomplish and finish it. And God says that as we enter to the new month, you need to finish that which you started. There must be a completion. So there are two things, God helping others to start and those who have started and are stuck in the middle to finish. I don't know, it could be probably education. You must finish a business that you must start 
or whatever it is God is saying we must bring to pass his prophetic word concerning our lives to pass by getting ourselves busy. We'll be praying more, talking less, stressing less, and praying more. Make sure prayer is the key calling on God to come through for you and help you. And you shall see his glory in the name of Jesus. Remember 10 p.m. Eastern time. Um, those of you in U.S. and also in Canada, but those of you in um, Europe, um, London is 3 a.m. Uh, 3 Monday to Thursday, Monday to Friday. And on Saturday, uh, on Saturday the time is uh, 4 a.m. And the number again for those of you in U.S. is 563 999 3626. I'm going to leave all the information at the bottom of this broadcast. Um, this week, I'll be releasing my new book. Get this. It's the new, new book. It's going to help you during this season of fasting and prayer. The title is called Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers. Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers. There are many demonic spirits that are working against people's blessing, whether marital blessing, financial blessing, blessing of your uh, business or whatever it is there are demons and they are witchcraft spirits that destroys in this book i'm going to reveal to you some deep revelations that will help you to over to overcome this blessing destroyers these are powers that sabotage our stars our glory our blessings our breakthrough you will get this book on amazon you will get this book on amazon and um you just um Type in Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers by uh, Brother K. Boache. K A Y and the Boache is B O A C H I E. Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers. And get a copy and get a copy for somebody to bless you. It's my newest book that I'm releasing this season and during the fasting. Some of the revelation in this book is 30 dreams that will show you your blessing when your blessing is under demonic and witchcraft attack. 30 dreams once you have these dreams you know that the devil is coming after your finances coming after your marriage coming after something good in your life you must know these dreams and so that nothing happens to us by chance god always speaks to us but we don't understand our dreams and so things bad things happen to us before your marriage was destroyed before you lost the job before something evil happened god had already revealed it to you through your dream but you didn't even know that this dream was pertaining to this I reveal to you 30 dreams that will reveal to you that your, your blessing is coming under witchcraft or demonic attack. Then I also give you 35 uh, and I also give you prayer point to cancel out these negative dreams and scriptures to use. When you wake up from that evil dream, the scriptures you must use to cancel and destroy it and the divine direction that you have to take. I also give you 35 prayers to cancel the evil dreams, as I've just told you. How to overcome four major causes of poverty. There are four major causes of poverty. I will show you in this book and how to overcome it. The spirit of poverty is real. Many of us are working and working and working, but the spirit of poverty will cause you to lose everything. You get money and problem will come and the problem will suck it up. When you are dealing with the spirit of poverty, not only can it deny you from having a, a blessing, financial blessing, but that spirit, will, if you manage to have blessings, this spirit will deplete and squander all your money. You get money and then there will be emergency. Your car is breaking. This is spoiling and somebody is calling you for emergency. By the time you realize your money is gone, it is a spirit. It's a demon. You will know how to overcome the four major causes of poverty. It will, I also give you 11 witchcraft activities. There are 11, some 11 witchcraft activities that destroys our blessing. I reveal it to you in this book. 16 demons that causes 16 demons that attack our finances and our blessing. 16 demons. I mentioned their name, their function, and how to pray and stop these demons. Get the book. Prayers to overcome demonic operation against your blessings. Prayers to overcome witchcraft activities. There are some major witchcraft activities that are come after our finances and our blessings. I reveal it to you. And nine spiritual elements to be to do to get blessed. Get a copy of this book. Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers. How witches and demons destroy our blessings. And it will 
it will help you. It will help you. Too many of us are losing blessings, losing our miracles, losing our financial blessing, marital blessing, breakthrough blessing because there are demonic spirits, witchcraft activities fighting us and we don't know how to work with it. And the spirit of poverty, this book is going to enlighten you. Go to Amazon and um, Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers by Brother K or K, Brother K Boachi and get a copy. God bless you.